Bippity boppity boo. <laughs> Today's video, I want to talk about sleep paralysis. Now, a lot of people experience this. A lot of people don't even know what this is, but people go to sleep and they feel like they being choked. Feel like they can't breathe. Like they, you know what I'm saying? Feel like your nostrils stuffed up. Then they feel like somebody's just grabbing you by the neck and it's just like you, like you can't breathe at all. That's sleep paralysis. What is sleep paralysis? Okay, I will be glad to elaborate. Sleep, par <laughs> sleep paralysis is when a demon, demonic spirit, attaches onto you in the spiritual world, right? And tries to hold you down. Like you ever had a dream and you clearly know that you finna wake up out this dream, but as you're trying to wake up, it's like you, your eyes closed and it's just like, you like kind of slipping like from going like from waking up out the dream it's just like something just holding you back like you can feel your arms and shit but it's like you just need that extra push for you to just wake up you see what i'm saying that's a demon holding you down that's sleep paralysis right now pretty much what that is is your body is in a cage you see what i'm saying like it's like demons are surround you surrounded by you you know what i'm saying because once you have a certain light around you you know and uh, that's the same thing, too. You got to watch what you eat before you go to bed, too. Like, a lot of people eat junk food and all that shit. And I made the video about sugar demons and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? It's good to do whatever you want to do in moderation. Moderation. You see what I'm saying? Some people go overboard. Eating all type of shit before they go to bed. And they be demonic spirits around them. Because you have a very powerful glow. Your aura could be shining so bright. And the demons attracted to that shit. And especially if you one of those people who just now get into spirituality. You just now learn how to astral project and meditate and all this shit. You want to go explore and shit. You're going too far about the uh, fourth dimensional realm. Then those demons can latch on to you. So you try to wake up. It's just like you you right there. But you need the extra push to wake you up and shit. Those is demons. And then another form of sleep paralysis is uh when you go to sleep and your body, like your leg or something, it just get to jumping and shit. You be like, what the fuck wrong with my leg? That's because it's like. Your body, your soul trying to escape out your body, but your body is in shackles. Your spirit is in shackles, you know what I'm saying? Because all the TV, all the bad food you eat, you know what I'm saying? If you know how to balance it out like I do, you know what I'm saying? You will be good, but everybody don't know how to do that. Because everything is about balance, you know what I'm saying? And uh, like your arm or something, just get the jerk in and shit, you be like, what the fuck? Because your soul trying to escape out your body, but it can't. Because you got too much poison on you. You see what I'm saying? That's another form of sleep paralysis, right? And if you want to really pretty much escape sleep paralysis you have to put up a shield a pyramid of protection and listen i said this before i want to say it again pyramid of protection right first things first before that you need to get some sun energy real talk real talk you need to get some sun energy what if the sun not out start earthing what is earthing dig a hole in the ground take your socks and shoes off put your feet in there pour some water in that hole put the dirt that you dug up put it like on top of your feet sit there you get electrolytes from your feet going up to your penile gland because the sun up there it's really the sun down there because the sun up there is a holographic projection coming from inner earth see what i'm saying this is basic stuff and uh get some moon energy too because the sun is the father the moon is the mother balance you see what i'm saying so you get that serotonin and that melatonin you build that up so when you go in the spiritual world they can't fuck with you because the light too bright but if your light kind of dim and they like, ooh, we got us one. You see what I'm saying? And uh, a lot of people die from that. Like, you ever had a dream? You got shot up in your a dream? Do you end up dead for real? You know what I'm saying? That shit real. That's sleep paralysis. And, uh, you got to build you a pyramid of protection. Get you a notebook. Draw a triangle on the notebook. It's, it's, don't make this harder than what it got to be. Draw a triangle on the notebook. Sometimes I got to elaborate. Some people be tweaking. Get you a notebook, right? A new notebook. Don't have nothing on the page or nothing. Make sure it's a clean piece of paper. Draw a triangle right in the middle of that. Then in the middle of that triangle, draw a little circle. Draw a line coming from that first point down to the middle of that circle. Then on the left, on the left side, draw a point from that corner right there to the side of that circle. Then go to the right side of that triangle. Draw a point from the side, from that right side to that circle. You gonna have like one point at the top, one point on the left, one point on the right. Then in the middle you, of that circle, you draw a 13. Then on top of the t <laughs> on top of the triangle, right, you draw a 13. Then on the left side of the little point, draw a 13. On the right side of the point, draw a 13, right? And then you put 13 13s, 13 number 13s around on the paper and shit. Then you get a picture of you, right, of you. 
place it on top of the triangle that you drew. Once you do that, you get you four pennies that's dated before 1982. Why before 1982? I would be glad to elaborate. Before 1982, because they were using real copper. What is copper? Copper is a metal, and metals come from the earth, right? See what I'm saying? So copper generates energy. Yes, and it will protect you. You see what I'm saying? Real talk. But try to aim for pennies like 1960, 1970. You know what I'm saying? And you only use four pennies because me, I use about, depends. Right now I'm using probably about 10 because I've been doing this shit for like four years. So I got this shit. You know what I'm saying? But if you use more than that, whatever you think about, go manifest quickly. Go manifest quickly. So you think about something slightly negative. You like, how the fuck? You put too many pennies. You draw too much energy to yourself. So get four pennies. Put them um, in the triangle. In the triangle form. One penny at the top, and then three at the bottom of that triangle where your picture at. You got you a pyramid, a pyramid of protection, sigil of magic. That's how you protect yourself, real shit. Simple as that.